Hello again, welcome back to Minecraft with Lord R. Right now, where were we? Oh yes, we were standing on the parapets of our wonderful castle, having a look at our beautifully manicured farm. Oh no, hang on, we were in a dirty, grubby little cave in the middle of nowhere, trying to work towards this. But I thought I'd give you a little look at what we're trying to accomplish, before we go digging around underground and getting ourselves killed a lot. This is our farm, with our wheat growing well, and the middle's glowstone. We'll cover how to get that later. Um, there's our pigs doing well. Chickens doing well. Over here's our cows. Oh, no, hang on, we haven't got any cows yet. I haven't found them. I'll cover these two later. They're a bit more psychedelic. Our pumpkin's growing, our melon's growing. And over there's a cane pyramid, which is sort of semi-working. I haven't quite ironed out the bugs with that one yet. We're currently standing in a lovely castle. Um, me and the British Trust are trying to bring it back to its former glory. As you can hear by the growls, there's still a few nasties floating about, but I think they're deep underground. We won't worry about them. You'll be seeing dungeons like this. Well, I hope you'll be seeing none of this, but I can find one. Uh, this one now is uh, all mine. I have nicked it. My tiny little bedroom. Interesting scene design. Not done by me. I think it's maybe a creeper, but I'm not sure. Some mention of cat god was made. And up here, you should be able to see a, a very interesting tree, which was again squatted by skeletons, which I've had a nice little blow with and cleared out. And even further up, I will give you a small glimpse, and only a small glimpse, of something very interesting. Did you catch that? There you go, that's all you're getting. Till later and the horrible noise that goes with it. That's a very interesting thing to discover. Right, I suppose we really should return back to our grubby little hole. Because that's all we've managed so far. There's our swamp biome over there. Okay, time to return. World. This is more like it. Home from home. Spiders in the background, grubby mess everywhere. Right, I have had a little wander around and topped up our animal situation a little bit. Again, the same problem as last time. You can find most things, but you can't quite find everything. I will have to do this now, really. We now have chickens, including one that's managed to escape out there. They're dropping eggs like good ones. Our cows didn't work, you see our baby cows now grown up to a fine, bouncing, springy thing. I've topped up our seeds a bit. So we've got a bit more wheat growing. I'll put some torches around the animals to keep the horrible green nasties away. And what we're going to do now, because we're going to be going caving in the immediate future, is we better go and find some coal. I believe there was some surface coal floating around, wasn't there? say without any real conviction. I don't want to go in there. It's dark and it's scary. And we're not ready for it yet. Now on the off chance I couldn't... Wow, hello spider. During the day these things are quite mild mannered. This one must have come out of a cave somewhere. It's only when it gets dark they tend to get a bit stroppy. Uh, this won't hurt too much. Ah, uh, we have coal. I know we had some around here somewhere. If not, I did actually chop a few trees, stick half the wood in the cooker as fuel, half of it in the top to burn, and got some charcoal. But, I would much rather have coal. But, if you can't find any on your map and an exposed rock, then that will be what you're going to need to do. Right. Between some of the coal we've got here, I won't grab it all for the minute. Time is of the essence. We'll quickly open up our controller. There's our 16 charcoal anyway. I've kept them with me. Some of our sticks, and we're going to make some torches. I think 40 will do for the minute. I think the rest of our coal and our sticks. As you notice, we still don't currently have any armour. We have a nice fresh sword, uh, two picks, shovel. This is the sort of things you're definitely going to need digging around in caves. Now, on the right, back near our house, there's been a lot of noise. Oh, would you believe it? Come right in front of us. We do have a quick look down here. 
I think it's somewhere in the better look. When caving, pick a side of the tunnel and put all your torches on that side. Now, let's see. Oh, bit of a drop and an oh. <laughs> Someone shot somebody else, eh? Alright, let's have a quick look back up this way. I seem to remember. I, look, oh, I know where I had a look at. The tunnel to start with. The one we were going to eradicate. If it didn't come up to scratch. And it does come up to scratch. I've had a quick notice down here, so I've cheated a bit. But again, we stick to one side, that way we can always know our way home. Down there looks very interesting. And again, along here looks quite interesting. Now, I don't normally fly into tunnels. Ah, I left a torch there earlier. Again, we're going to pick at the ready. Grab a few resources as we're going down. We're looking for iron, really. Hmm nasty tunnel where things will drop on your head. Whoa, in fact something is around here. Who, I wonder, and where? Come on, show yourself. I would like to do... Oh, you're down there, are you? Right, okay. This is where it always makes sense to have your food topped up. To its max. Like, as you notice, I haven't. What happens when you plan these videos? Right, I'm coming for you. Where are you? You're down there, are you? There you are. I'm about to give you a headache, mate. Whoa, it's two of them! I do not want to do any dying. <laughs> come on, come get me. Well, I think I might actually be shooting each other now. <laughs> this is what happens when one shoots another one by accident. They get quite stroppy about it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, come on, you little shit. Stick your head up. Where are you? Oh, one of you's got to have survived. So, you know, I'll break the wall number one and put a torch on the other side just to have a better look. Where are you? Oh, you little toad. Come on, I'll see you. I'm gonna chop you up, you little rat. Right, time to go get you. Oh, two of them. Come on, stick your head out round here. I'll we'll shoot each other, I don't mind which. Oh, my heart's going there. I am panicking. <laughs> oh dear. And these two are not cooperating. Come here and die painfully. Right, it's very dark down here. I'm going to get back up. Chances are you probably couldn't see a thing down there. Oh, blimey, what the hell's going on here? This is where I die painfully. Run away! Run away! Run away! <laughs> oh, shit. Well, your first experience of caving has been great fun, hasn't it? <sighs> Like enough, full health, so I'm healing. Whew. Now I picked this cave because it's a nice calm one. <laughs> Sheesh. Could I have been more wrong? Oh, oh you little rat. <laughs> yeah, the amount of spiders we killed, we've got a bow actually. We could actually have gone and built a bow. Which I think we might do before we go further into this cave, but I'm sorry, I've got a score to settle now. There's at least two of you. So and so, isn't it? Come on! That's your bun down. Where's the other one? Uh, something is there. Which will probably mean that he's round the corner there. He is. Damage. I'm just hoping there isn't one round here. Come on in. Yeah, now stick your head out. 